This video will give an overview of how to use the RoboForm Android app. After the initial installation and setup, when you open the RoboForm Android app, you will be prompted to sign in. After sign in, you will be on the Start Pages pinned menu. This menu is where you can view and edit your pinned RoboForm items. These are logins, identities, bookmarks, or safe notes, which you have pinned for easy access. The other menus in the Start page are logins, where you can view and edit your created logins, safe notes, where you can view and edit your created safe notes, and an all menu where you can view all of your RoboForm items in one place. The logins, safe notes, and all menus have subsections for your popular, most used items, your recent, most recently used items, an A to Z alphabetical list of your items, and allow you to choose between grid, compact, and list views of your items. In the bottom right corner of all these menus is a blue plus button. On the pinned and all menus, this button allows you to create a new safe note, identity, bookmark, or login. On the logins and safe notes menus, it allows you only to create a new login or safe note respectively. To view the available options for any RoboForm item, press and hold on the item. A menu will appear presenting you with different options depending on the type of item you select. If you tap the three dots in the upper right corner of the start page, you will see the global options to sync, view and edit your settings, and lock the RoboForm app. At the bottom of the page, to the right of the start page, you will see the identity section. The identity section allows you to view or edit the different categories of information stored in your identities. You can select the identity you wish to view or edit or create a new identity by tapping the name at the top left corner of the screen. The blue plus button at the bottom right of the screen allows you to add different types of information to your identities easily. Tapping the three dots at the top right of the screen will open a menu with options to create a shortcut to the identity on the home screen, rename, move, delete, or send the identity, as well as the global options to sync, view and edit your settings, and lock the RoboForm app. To the right of the Identity section, you will see the Browser section. In this section, you will see RoboForm's built-in web browser. RoboForm's browser allows for direct access to RoboForm's form-filling features on websites, similar to the experience on desktop. In the browser's address bar, you can also execute a web search via your preferred provider. Google, Yahoo, Bing, and DuckDuckGo are currently the available options. While using the RoboForm browser, you can tap the three dots in the upper right corner to see the browser-specific options to go back a page or forward a page while browsing, refresh the current page, generate a password, view a page in desktop mode, view your search history, view your download history, and print, as well as the global options to sync, view and edit your settings, and lock the RoboForm app. To the right of the browser section, you will see the tools section. In this section, you will see options to view the RoboForm Password Generator, our powerful password generator with customizable parameters to ensure that no matter what the password requirements of a site are, you can generate a secure password which complies, view the Sharing Center, where you can share your RoboForm items with others, view the Security Center, where you can view the strength of your passwords and see if you have reused any of them or have duplicate logins, and view the Emergency Access page where you can set up an emergency contact in order to give a trusted contact access to your RoboForm data in the event of an emergency. If you tap the three dots in the upper right corner of the Tools section, you will see the global options to sync, view and edit your settings, and lock the RoboForm app. No matter where you are within the app, in the upper right corner you will see a box with a number in it. This allows you to open new tabs within the app which is useful for when you are using the RoboForm browser or when you would like to switch between different sections of the app without having to do extra navigation.